Hi, my name is Jonea Kemper, and I'm the lead game designer at the Player Program Partnered Games Project over at Carnegie Mellon. One of the things we get to do is work with children to design new games that help us think about co-ops and work with them. You are going to be playing Zilla Beach, which is a rhythm game that is much like our Zilla City game. You'll still be playing a Zed, and you'll still be using Zed Tech, but this time you'll be doing it to the beat. There's tons of levels and a lot of customization and some really great ways that you can work with your cobot hoverboard to take down those Toxie bots once and for all. So let's get into it. Welcome to Zilla Beats. Get You're going to start off in our clubhouse and you are welcomed in by our coach over here and you can customize your character in the next room. So you can customize tons of different things. The way your face looks, your skin color, you can customize your eyes, what you're wearing, all sorts of cool things, even your hairstyle. So play around, see what you like the most. You can make yourself, you can make someone you know, you can make someone you want to be, you can make anything that you think is fun, whoever your Zed is, that is what you can do in our character creator. Then you just exit right back out using these arrows, and when you're ready to get going on some Toxibots, you'll click through on the left here to get to this area. Each area in the city has Toxibots and it gets harder and harder until you get to area four where it's the hardest. Um, you're going to use your Cobot hoverboard to do all of your work and moving around the city and it's going to help you get around a lot of difficult areas. So you're going to start off slow in area one. You're going to press space bar to hit these Toxibots with cupcakes. You have a pause button, so if you need to go do something else, you're not gonna magically like lose your game. Um, at the end of, and you can also restart, but at the end of the level when you beat it, you're gonna get your score, how many you got. So wrecked, how many you completely wrecked, boop, and how many you kind of missed, and who escaped. As the levels get harder, you're going to get bonked, which means there may be some objects that try and run into you. Like I said, you can finish, once you finish the level, this will be green, so you can move on to the next level. Let's look at a more difficult area. So area two, two. This has a programming screen that pops right up and it shows some things you could have your Cobot hoverboard do. You could ignore them. Um, let's see what happens when I just play it regular. Okay. Uh-oh. Okay, let's go back and see what happens if I choose to restart the song and do a little light programming of my hoverboard here. Okay. Oh, switches. I ended up hitting a lot more and not bonking as much, so that was fun. Don't forget, you can play around with your code. Here you can change what you're throwing with your Z-Tech. Um, really just look through all of the levels once you get to them and see how you can change your Cobot hoverboard and what that does as you go through each level. And that was Zilla City Beats. You can do a ton of really cool things. Don't forget to mess with the programming of your Cobot hoverboard and really get into the swing of things. Thanks a lot for playing. Game on.